This is Twit. So uh, today to the arena, I brought uh, I brought Play on Cloud, and what Play on Cloud is, it's a service that logs you into any of the streaming services that you pay for or that are free, and you can pay for credits, and these credits will record the videos for you, and then you can download them to your device. <laughs> and so, <clears throat> excuse me, this past summer. I've been working on a home archival project, archiving my photos and my movie library and kind of getting everything from physical media into digital storage. Mm -hmm. And uh, part of this has included creating a little channel for myself. So I have little channels that play throughout the day when I'm feeling like having TV on in the background. And I like to just have shows play in a certain order. Uh, it could be shows that I'm watching currently, or it could be shows that I'm wa re-watching. As we all know, I do that every year annually <laughs> with Beverly Hills 90210, which is why I'm the expert. Uh, so what I do with Play On is I will record these things. I'll record from HBO. I'll get my episodes of Insecure and uh, put them in there. I'll go to Hulu and I'll get uh, my episode. Actually, I've got some movies from there recently. I'll go to Netflix and get my Riverdale and get all of that downloaded. Riverdale. Uh, I can go to, let's see, we've got, I know Spectrum is a, is a cable thing people use. If you've got logins for the CW and CBS and NBC, you can also go in there and download. Uh, Crackle's got it, PBS, which is great, and YouTube. Oh. What is this thing running around on your screen? It's, it's not my app. Oh, it's, it's a, something let different. Let me turn it off. Is it a, oh, it's a, one of those Nico Atsumi <laughs> things, right? <laughs> Hold on, I have to turn it off. I'm sorry. Okay, I can't turn it off. You're just going to have to deal with okay. it. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> I just uh, wanted to be clear. It's, it's another it Android app I have or... running. It's a little uh, character it puts on your screen. Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> this is why I love Chromebook. Uh, this is why I wanted to show you my Chromebook. So you do all these are the channels, and you go into the channels. It, ah, sorry, I, like I refreshed. Let's go into Netflix real quickly. And I'm going into my account and uh, I don't know, this is only downloaded, I don't know. We're just gonna pick something. Um, Bill Nye the Science Guy. So you can go in there into the collection and then you tap on the episode that you want and then you add it to a queue. And below it, it'll tell you how many, you can't see this, but I will tell you what it says. It'll tell you how many recording credits you have. They vary in price. We'll get to that in a second though. Uh, let me show you the rest of the interface. So here are the recordings I have from today. As you can see, I uh, have the first four episodes of the first season of Highlander, which I'm putting into a fall playlist. Lots of dark themed shows I'm putting into the run. Uh, I also have Catfish, which I also feel is a very dark show uh, about social media and how it can, you know, affect us. Huh. And <laughs> these Man, are you just- you watch some dark stuff. <laughs> These are just the, and then over here is my queue, and this is the recordings I have queued. And what you see up here is a uh, loading bar, and this is the current recording. It's currently recording Catfish. So it's playing in the cloud and recording it, just like a DVR would. Whoa. So I have to wait the full 41 minutes and 19 seconds for, I have to wait for the full recording to record before it's ready for me. But after it's done, I have it. So today I downloaded Power Rangers the movie, I Tanya, some episode of Catfish. You really I got went Mighty on a, Morphin Power yeah, Rangers. Power Ranger run here. Yeah, I have like a whole thing. You have a thing. Um, and then it'll give you little messages, let you know when stuff is done. And then you can go to the settings <laughs> and go to a storage plan and see plans. So you can pay for plans or you can buy credits. So it, it's up to $19 a month for a terabyte of storage. That's what I'm reading for you <laughs> off of here. It's okay. It's actually just my, um, it's just my crap email. So it's fine. Okay. It's the email I use when I don't want it connected to my regular email. Uh, or you can buy credits. So what I do is I buy credits. Uh, you can get a hundred for 30 bucks, four for $1.99. Today they gave me a deal 25 for 3.99. So I jumped on it uh. and, I, and I bought credits and that's why I ended up downloading the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. That's what I would have done too. Yeah. And you can choose your video quality. I just choose standard def because I don't care. 
yeah. I don't need high quality. I ended up I end up downloading it off the Chromebook and I put it onto the Plex server, media server in her house. And then that's how my Plex server is is local only. So it's only playable at my house. But if I'm on the go, I'll put it, you know, I'll transfer it to my Pixel 2. Uh, does it cost more for HD versus standard? I no, it uses more storage. So oh, if you're okay. paying for storage, then it's gonna use up more storage. Mm. But I like to watch things on my tiny little Pixel too. So that's why I also get standard def. Right, it just looks yeah. better. Plus, yeah. your selection of programs is not high def. Uh, they exactly. were all filmed in NTSC or Thank PAL. you for reminding me how low def our our childhood was. Yes, I, I've just <laughs> fin finished rewatching uh, Stargate. Sorry, yeah. not Star, Star Trek Deep Space yes. Nine, and it's noticeable how full HD, how on a 4K TV it looks yeah. not so good. So great for storage, great for exactly. data plans. So one thing about Play On, just to keep in mind, is they will not keep your recordings for you in the cloud. They will remove them after seven days. So you basically are using the DVR for the reason of playing back offline. Uh, also, oh, okay. you cannot log into anything you don't pay for, or don't have a valid subscription for, and you are paying per recording, so it can add up, but it's just a nice, useful thing. I have really, I've really enjoyed this process, and that's why I showed it on my Chromebook, because it's so, not what I use on my phone. Yeah, that's super cool. Just I a like quick it. question. On your Chromebook, can you store to SD or micro SD? Yes, I have a little... Uh, no, I don't. Not on this one. That's on my okay, other. Okay, so play on, <laughs> play, on, play on enables you to store to. I to plug in a USB and then I move it because right now, unfortunately, Windows file system is not supported by Chrome OS, so I cannot drop mm. it onto the family server. That which might is change on PC. I know. I don't know. I, know. I don't know if that will change, but I hope it does. That's that's the other reason I really want it, so yeah. I can play, so I can transfer files between the family server. Awesome. Play on cloud. Uh, great demo. Love it. Looks great. Uh, check it out in the Play Store.